I got, I'll take care of it. What does one solid headshot do with this thing? Fuck off. It does fuck off. This is very anticlimatical. I didn't want to kill her. Now I gotta find Dean. Ow! I hate this shit! Truly. Um. Put this under one. Yeah. I actually really do hate this. This is not good. This is awful. I hate this. Get me the fuck out of this damn villa and casino. I mean it. Okay, local map, he should be dead ahead. I cannot go this way. I see. Dean Domino. She's got to be underneath or above, no? Backstage door that requires a key.
I don't fucking know. Um, wall safe maybe has a key. Probably not. Nope. There's we go then. I'm dead. I see why people did not like this DLC at all. I'm that ghost still alive. I'm here. Correct that. Or break him. I'm here. Oh, a key has slid now. Okay, cool. So you showed. Felt the collar start kicking again as soon as the elevator doors rattled open. Think you're going to upstage me here at the Sierra Madre? I don't think so. Now that I'm inside, well, I don't need... How did you get from the gala event to here? Me? I was halfway off the rooftop, through the service tunnel, and beelining for the gate before the light show started. And before Vera finished her gala speech. I knew what had happened with music in the streets and lights in the sky. Ghost people. Lots of them. But that was your problem. Anyway, front gate was open, nowhere I was letting you get in first. I walk in. There's a flash, and I'm here. Must have been Sinclair's security. He always had a thing about letting any threats into the casino. Security system's twitchy that way. Me, though, I'm a guest here, so I guess I got the royal treatment after all. Was stabbing me in the back for the Sierra Madre? You think I'm the bad guy here? I'm not the one slapping bomb collars on innocent folks and flicking the switch. You think and I'm flicking I'm the switch? I'm stabbing you in the back. I was facing you all the time. This heist, I planned it lifetimes ago. You and that old man, tourists. Time for a little show. I'll just grab a seat and watch how this plays out from backstage. Security can handle it from here. And the callers? You sound awfully eager to kill someone whose life is tied to yours. No, no. The callers. I know what happened now. Sure, mine activated, but it feels different, the electronic tap dance inside. I can kill you and still make it out while security is busy frying you to a crisp. Hands are clean, then smooth sailing to the Sierra Madre. And what makes you think you can slip out? Way I figured it, you'll try and run for the exit. And only I know where the key is. And where the safest place in the whole theater is. Backstage. You, you're trapped down there. And you couldn't shut off the speakers, unlock the doors, or cancel security if you tried. Light. Light. So as long as I make sure I don't run for the exit. What? What now? Try and come back here? 
No, you belong out in the audience. I mean, not like, uh, you could get backstage. That key you snagged, it won't work. Hmm. I guess we'll see. Of all the... Where the hell are those stupid holograms already? Even if you get back here, you won't live long, trust me. Let's find out. Ain't, ain't no still alive. Correct that. Or break him. So you should. Okay, this is different. Very different. Okay, where to next? I need a certain key. I'm having a bitch of a time finding. Yeah, that's fine. I That's fine. A blackmail tape, huh? Song. This is creepy. It's it's actually really hard to do this. So what, what am I doing? And where is this?
Damn. I do be quick saving though. Oh wow, this light didn't even stay up. Where the fuck? Oh, it must be up there. Well, how do I get up there? Oh, I, I see. I made it. Somehow. Somehow I've made it and I have no idea how. Now this allows me You're resourceful, I'll give you that. It's going to take a lot more than juggling keys and shooting speakers to stop me. As I see it, all I need to do is kill you, then make a run for the exit. You do the same, you'll be clawing at the lock until your head blows off. So, maybe you and I should have a little chat. Just like we did when you first waltzed into town. Mm -mm. Oh, this hollow tape in your safe. You don't just stop robbing casinos, do you? What's that tape? Oh, the one with Sinclair's woman, Vera. What about it? You want me to give you a standing ovation? Were you blackmailing Vera Keys to break into the Sierra Madre? Blackmail is such a strong word. I asked her, she said yes, then... She started to get cold feet. I blame Sinclair. He was such a victim that maybe she felt it would be too easy. It doesn't matter. What did you want her to do? Sinclair built this whole town to accommodate her. Same with the casino's voice lock. He wanted to make sure she had access to everything. And since I already had access to Vera, well... That meant I had access to the vault, too. Hmm. What were you blackmailing her with? What wasn't I blackmailing her with? Chem use, indiscretions, more chem use, the usual Hollywood tune. Like Sinclair, people are the architects of their own misfortunes. Leave themselves wide open for someone to waltz right in and take what they want. As long as they take a single step into the trap, get a few pictures, get a little dirt, and that person's your piano. Vera? Med X was her thing. Even super stimmed herself for the after rush. Sick. Hmm. Why did you need her? Because she could get closer to Sinclair than I ever could. He built this place for her. Well, after the two chanced to meet. Sinclair was already puppy-eyed, so all I had to do was the introductions. She smiled, fluttered her eyes, showed a little leg. And he built this whole place for her. Made her the key to his vault. Like a joke, because of her name. A fake Hollywood name. 
except Sinclair didn't know, I'd been there first. I could twist her whatever direction I wanted. Go on. All she had to do was get inside the Sierra Madre for the gala, then use her voice to open the door. After that, smooth sailing would have been the biggest heist in history. Sinclair left holding the bag, ruined. So what happened? The bomb. Vera got sealed in here. A few hundred years go by, give or take. Almost the end of the story. Then you came along. Now we finish the job. We? Rob the Sierra Madre, rip out its heart. Last chapter of Frederick Sinclair. Close the book. Okay, so what's the beef with Sinclair? Problem? All high and mighty. Lording it over everyone. Acting so self-righteous, like nothing could touch him. He was the one with the problem. Never got mad at anything, nothing seemed to shake him. Even after his life kept getting dragged through the dirt. Always kept looking for the bright, shining future in everything. So... I decided to take everything from him. But what did he do to you? Do to me? What, weren't you listening? No. He thought he was better than me. Don't believe me? Look around. This big casino. This big colossal monument. Think it was for some woman? No. All ego. All self-righteous in lights. Fit him perfect. Had to take him down a few pegs, bring him down to my level. Begin again? Some things you don't get up from. I was going to prove it. How? I didn't know at first. Then the old man showed up. You showed up. Then that woman showed up. Covered in scars. The one who makes all the hand signs, a little tight around the corners of her mouth. I put her in the clinic, tuned her like an instrument. If she heals up, it's not going to be her voice speaking anymore. That is, if the Sierra Madre didn't get her. If it did, well, there's enough of Vera around for me to spend a few years piecing a book together. Hmm. And if she is alive? Then she can make some beautiful music. I'm not banking on it. So here's the short of it. Piece together Little Miss Viriki's song in the right order. Sierra Madre opens its legs when in business. Hmm. You ready to die, Domino? Always asking questions when you should be shooting. You're a piece of work, I'll give you that. Made it. Another fragment. Good. Almost have the entirety of what I need from the music archives. Once you have the last fragment, you can thread the archives together at the main floor terminal.
And, and, uh. Oh, I'm gonna light on fire right now. But not without taking them with me. Welcome in, Nuka Love. Really? Criticals. Got you. It's the range for me. Um, retrieve the emergency door key to the Cantina Madrid kitchen. Well, this is a restroom. There's ammo in here. I'll take it. And here. They're giving me a lot of stem packs now. Get it? Huh. Got you. Next up is the restaurant. Going to make casino burn. No more being. Hurry up and deal with the casino burn. Is of no use no to us. more being. Oh, with the God. Please let me help us. 
If you don't, then you're going to make Casino burn. No more being back in the cage. Stop what you're doing. We can can hear you now. Not much Not listening to me. Tired of being your minder. Tired of putting dog to sleep. He wakes up in cage, hungry. Dog wants to protect you. Must be a back you. entrance to the kitchen. Always Check the main casino the side corridors. Find it. I don't know. A lot of shit happening. I mean, maybe? That idiot's opened the gas valves. A single spark, or he sets off his coma. The casino's going to burn. Us, along with him. Shut off the gas valves or that idiot will kill us all. Kitchen knives. Knives that are too sharp. That's not that's not a thing. Fuck. Tired of you. Tired of play. All fire now. Burn away. No! Talk! Fuck! Shut off the gas valve so that idiot will kill us all. What do you mean, get out? You know what? I'm going to load up the the autosave. Turn off the gas valve so that idiot will kill us all. Download the Starlight Hologram. Now, dog, 
will kill us both unless you do something. Never felt him so strong before. He won't listen to my voice. He's... He's... Hungry. Come here, or Dog will chase you. Break you until you no run anymore. Dog, stay. If you don't, Master will be mad. Hmm? Master? Don't want Master to be mad. What does Master want Dog to... Uh, listen to you. Can't hold him back much longer. Tell him to pull on his chain as hard as... Dog can. What Master wants, Dog can do. Please don't be mad with Dog. Dog? The master sent me. He commands you to listen to my voice now. Master? Master? Dog? Dog is listening. D Both of us are. Tell him to listen to me. Then we can get out of this. Finally. And... Now Dog is listening to voice. Your voice only. Imagine the voice, not as a voice, but as water. Look at the voice now. What do you see? Dog can see the voice. Looks just like Dog. And Dog looks just like me. You've hurt yourself inside. Do you see now? See? In the water. Dog understands now. Dog knows what happened. Step into the water. Step into yourself. If Dog... If Dog goes into the water, Dog can't help if Master gets mad. You were nice to Dog. Dog wants to help. He's right. If you merge us, then... I... We, or whatever we become, we can't help you when you reach whatever's at the Sierra Madre's end. And Dog... Dog doesn't want to unremember you, may forget you. We will forget almost all that has happened here. You'll be alone, at the old man's mercy. Like Dog. Like me. I don't want you to be under anyone's control, even mine. You were there all the time. All the time. You were there. And so close. Together. Together. You alright? Who... Who are you? What is this place? We're trapped inside a casino in a poisonous city. That... That was not the answer I was expecting. I don't know you, yet I feel like I do, and a feeling of... gratitude. I... Forgive me, I... I'm wounded. This chain... This bear trap on my arm... How did I even get this far with these wounds? The pain is excruciating. I... I need to rest for a moment. If you get the strength to leave, do so quickly. <sighs> Thank you. For whatever you have done. I will remain here. Need to get my strength back. 